Since the very first bedtime, all around the world, children have known that once their mothers and fathers tuck them in and shut off the light, that there are monsters hiding in their closets, waiting to emerge. But what they don't know is, it's nothing personal. It's just their job. Whoa! Ah. Nobody here. Huh? There's, there's no kid. There's supposed right, to be a kid. There's no kid to scare. I'm panicking because there's a total lack of kid here. Let's just check the schedule. It's very embarrassing. Yeah. Well, let me see. Nine o'clock. Yep, nine o'clock. Boys bedroom. Boys bedroom. Out of Magnolia. <sighs> Magnolia. Give me that. It's Mongolia. Mike, does this look like Mongolia to you? Yeah, yeah, well, yeah. you kind of. Uh, okay, you remember the fifth grade? Yeah. When you spent all your time passing notes to Susie Boyles? Loved it. The rest of us were studying geography. This is not Mongolia. Uh, would you listen to this? Blame it on the little guy. How original. He must have read the schedule wrong with his one eye. All right, come on. Uh, don't take it personal. You were thinking that. Don't you were be thinking so that. sensitive. Uh, come on, buddy. Little Blinky. Don't, don't your do buddy? that. Who's I'm daddy? resisting you. Come on. Don't make me come like on. you. Don't, I don't want to like on, you now. All right. <laughs> hey, guess which planet I am? Huh? Come on, look. Guess which planet I am? Okay, I'm going to go back to the break room before all the donuts are gone. Hey, the, don't you even get it, you big throw rug? Oh, nice doggy. <laughs> nice big doggy. Sully, Sully, open the door.